Ducati M1100 Monster for sale on eBay. In the paperwork it comes with its V5 registration document. No former keepers. It's a one owner from new. I've got an HPI printout that shows the bike is all completely clear. No accidents or finance or anything else there in the bike's history to be concerned about. It's got its service books and things. Um, got a bookmark in there to show you that one there has been serviced. So, um, so it's got that one, that one, that one. I think that's it. Oh, and another one there. So it's been done at Metropolis in London. So there's that. <coughs> it's got. A load of Ducati dealers. It's got the handbook. And it's got some other thing here. I don't know what that is. Something to do with Ducati and a load of foreign languages. Probably got English as well, as well, and I expect. The bike's been fitted with Bike Track. This is a Road Angel um, product and various codes and things in there. So this is how you can track your bike on um, on your phone. Got some kind of a charger in there for some reason, I don't know what that does. But anyway, um, it's got that, that should give you an insurance discount if you're going to use it. It's got keys in here from Metropolis of Cab. It's got the spare original key there. And it also has the um, code card there. But anyway, that's that. So looking around the bike, just a few little things to point out. At some stage, rather, this bike has um, hang on, the picture's gone. Hang on a sec. At some stage, rather, the bike has fallen over on the right-hand side, and I'll show you the marks that we've got on the bike. They're pretty minor and irrelevant, really. Um, nobody's done anything about repairing any of these things. But anyway, there's um, <coughs> there's a couple of little boot marks on this cover here where the ride was climbed on and just touched the boot on there. They would probably come off I would think but because it's got this sort of matte sort of silvery finish it's probably you need to get it off more carefully than just using some like tea cut. I'm not quite sure how you do that but I'm sure there'll be a way of doing that. Um, there's a little mark on the tip of the end of the exhaust there. These are standard exhausts on this bike. Um, there's that. There is on the twist grip and the bar and this is quite a close up there. There's a little mark on it there. There's a little mark on the back of the right hand mirror. And the clutch cover has got a little dent in it there. Now these things are really minor, really. If you look for them you can see them, but they're not obvious on there. Also the steering stop bolt, which is a hollow bolt, has um, got strained. I mean you could just leave that or you could change it. Um, anyway, there's that. it's a, it's a pretty, really minor thing. The steering stop itself is fine. It's just the bolt, that, the adjusting thing. Um, this brake lever there is very slightly bent out to the right. You could straighten that if you wanted to, I'm sure. Um, and that's it. And the last thing is just a reminder to let you know that I am buying used bikes. So if you've got a bike you want to sell and you don't live too far away, let me know and I'll get you a price for it. Uh, there we go. Good luck with the bidding.